The Honorable Minister for Indigenous and Northern Relations. Thank you, Madam Speaker. It is with great pride that I have the opportunity today to recognize the 100th year of Hutterite colonies in Manitoba. It was June 1918 that six colonies migrated from the Dakota Territory to Manitoba. James Valley, Maxwell, Huron, Milltown, Bonhomme, and Rosedale were established, and today there are 118 colonies throughout our province. Originating in Austria in the 16th century, Jacob Hutter developed a communal form of living based on the New Testament book of Acts of the Apostle, which was distinct from other Anabaptists. It was during the First World War that Manitoba became a home for the Hutterites, who chose to abandon their American colonies in order to remain pacifists. Over the past 100 years, Hutterites have traditionally owned and operated large amounts of land, as well as hog, dairy, turkey, chicken, and egg productions. In more recent years, they have ventured into the manufacturing sector. Examples in the Agassiz constituency of their successes can be seen at Acadia Colony with Community Trust Limited and Baker Colony with better air manufacturing. Hutterites are well known and respected for their compassion and generosity to anyone in need. I would like to acknowledge the significant and supportive role Hutterite women have within their colonies with their exemplary gardening, baking, and sewing skills. I always look forward to visiting my lifelong friends at Riverdale Colony for serenity, support, and a cup of coffee. I'd like to recognize the late Selma Medell, who was the first Hutterite to be inducted into the Manitoba Agriculture Hall of Fame for her many contributions to agriculture in Manitoba. On behalf of this legislature, I want to congratulate all Hutterite colonies in Manitoba for 100 years of being generous neighbors and good stewards of the land. You are an inspiration to all. Happy 100 years in our province and best wishes for your next generations. Please join me in welcoming my friends from Acadia and Baker Colonies. <laughs>